hi all in this video we will understand how to load a sql server table data into a flat file using informatica transformations for this in sql server database i will create a table with two fields one is id and name in that here i am taking the database as source in source database i have created this table and i am inserting data into this table here id 1 and name santosh and i am inserting another record id 2 name harish id3 name arun i am inserting these three records into header table now source we have three records with id and name using informatica transformation i will load these three records into a flat file in sources i have opened informatica designer in this under source tab from sources i will import header table into this here this is a odbc connection here this is a source header and as target i will take a flat file create i will create a flat file with the name target underscore start file create and for this start file i will take two fields with the name id and name first field id with the data type as in and i'm taking the second field that is name the data type as string and the length as 50 here we have a option flight file information we have delimited and fixed with flat files in delimited we have taken advanced options here the column delimited is comma we can take it as a space these are the different delimiters this is for new line this is for vertical so like this we have different delimiters here i have taken comma okay we have created the target transformation as flat file by default here the file will be stored in the location of informatica folder 9.0.1 under server under info shared under target files this in this folder the file will be saved for this i will create informatica mapping under mappings i will create a new one i'm giving the name as m underscore target underscore flat file from sources i'm taking header i'm drag this into mapping designer and from target transformations means target folder i'm taking 
the target plot file as the mapping designer. I'm mapping these two into target transformation. Saving the mapping. Now I will create a session for this mapping under workflow manager. I am creating a new task with the name s underscore m underscore target underscore plot file I am associating this session with target plot file mapping I am editing session properties like connections under connections I am changing the source database to source this is our table Exist in this exist in this database. Under source connections also. Source. Now I will create a workflow for this session. Under workflow designer. Workflow create w underscore target plot file I am taking target plot file into this pane I am joining these two with the line task and I am running this workflow Start workflow from task. This is our target plot file workflow. Here the session succeeded successfully. We can view the session log. Under session log, we can see that the records will be loaded into a plot file. Means a plot file will be created with these three records. Here source load summary. From source, we have three records with id and name and this is the target load summary in target we can observe that output rows are 3 affected rows are 3 and applied rows are 3 in our plot file folder means target files a new file will be created this is the date 17th august 421 just now so i am opening this plot file using notepad here three records one two three with id and santosh harish and arun with name here the uh, comma is a delimiter to separate two fields you can observe the data in the source database three fields it is same with plot file this one thank you